Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube channel. This video is presented by Dr. Shubham Jelkar. In today's video we are going to learn about various equipment and instrumentation that will be used while fabricating complete denture. As soon as you get admitted to the college, you are welcomed in Department of Prosthodontics with the list of instrument. Without those, you are not allowed to enter into the lab and those instrument you are not even familiar with. You also going to see various equipment that are present in the lab, which might make you curious what and how they are used. So in today's video, we will be discussing about 1. Steps in fabrication of complete denture and then 2. Stepwise we will see various instruments that being used while performing clinical and laboratory procedure. So let's start. Steps involved in fabrication of complete denture. In the first step, primary impression is being made by the dentist after choosing the right impression material and right type and size of stock tray this step is called as primary impression thereafter you took the impression and pour it to prepare a primary cast which is usually made with dental plaster and in the primary cast we will mark the anatomical landmark adapt the spacer make tissue stop then fabricate special tray and this special tray will be used to make the secondary impression now with the help of special tray, dentist is going to perform border molding, ask patient to do the functional movement, later he makes secondary impression with the help of secondary impression material, such as zinc oxide, eugenol, later he need to made master cast, out of secondary impression, and for this, they may use beading and boxing method, which will develop land area into the master cast once we done with the master cast, we will make denture base by using self cure acrylic, or any temporary denture base material can be used. And then we will fabricate the occlusal room in both the maxillary and mandibular denture base. Now it's patient's third visit, and doctor will evaluate the vertical dimension, check aesthetics, phonation, and various marking are marked on the occlusal room. And this is how you perform jaw relation. And this jaw relation need to be mounted in the articulator. Once articulation is done it will now be acting to simulate maxillomandibular activity and jaw movements you can start with the arrangement of teeth with the selected size shape and shade of teeth depending on the dentogenic factors after finishing with the teeth arrangement you can ask the patient for try in appointment and you can evaluate the aesthetic phonation as well as very light contact of maxillary and mandibular teeth make sure your patient not bite hard at this time Make correction if required once the dentist and patient get satisfied with the outcome, dentist can move forward to finish and polish the wax arrangement, you can do some characterization. And then, make a final prosthesis with the help of permanent denture base material and this involved de-waxing, investing, packing and bench curing, polymerization. After it gets acrylizes, do the deflasking, remove the adherent, finish and polish, you are ready to insert the denture in patient mouth, check for any discrepancy. And then you are ready to send the patient with a smile, don't forget to give the post-operative instruction. Coming to the instrumentation, basic prosthodontic instruments, a must have instruments, for all the student, this all the instruments, you going to require any time, and every time. Here you can appreciate, and find them all. These are the list, of all those basic instruments. Let's start with the first clinical appointment. In the first appointment, we take case history, examine, diagnose and decide the treatment planning. During examination, we should have the sets of instruments. Mouth mirror, uses for indirect vision, retraction and tissue protection. Periodontal probe, its function is to measure depth of gingival sulcus, check mobility and also to measure overjet and overbite. Explorer are very sharp instruments, also used to examine tooth surfaces for cavity, calculus, or defects using sense of touch, tactile. Tweezers are used to place and remove small objects from the oral cavity, that is cotton pellets, root canal instruments and wedges. Saliva ejector, its function is to remove saliva and maintain dry field using low volume evacuation during cementation or impression making. 